Hey, I'm Emma Garlett and welcome to Paint It Black. As we start another year, the debate around changing the date of Australia Day comes front and centre. This conversation has already started on social media. We were ignorant to the history of that date. Captain Cook never discovered Australia. You can't be like, oh, this, this, this is ancient history. No, it's not. But you were pressed in the mark. 60,000 years of bloodline, you ain't even got spies. The current date of Australia Day, January 26, needs to be changed. Let me explain why. Right now, many people refer to Australia Day as Invasion Day or Survival Day. This is because the day represents when the British people invaded First Nations people's land. January 26 currently marks the anniversary of the arrival of the British fleet and the raising of the Union Jack by Commander Arthur Phillip at Sydney Cove in 1788. It was the day Australia was invaded by the British, massacres occurred, and was the start of the dispossession of Indigenous peoples on their land. This day led to many issues, public policy and laws, which were created to eradicate Indigenous people and their culture. These ramifications can still be felt today. I believe the day we celebrate this great nation needs to be inclusive and reflect the true Australia. Australia Day needs to change to another day in January to represent who we are and not celebrate the invasion of the country or massacres of Indigenous people. It could be a Monday or a Friday. We can create a long weekend. Changing the day is easy, and some people have already moved their Australia Day celebrations. Here in WA, some local governments have cancelled or shifted their celebrations, such as the cities of Fremantle and Vincent and the town of Cambridge, which has stirred controversy in the news. What they're doing is they're undermining the day by saying to councils, well, you don't have to hold citizenship ceremonies if you don't want to. And that means that if you're a future citizen of this nation, you don't have now the choice to be able to have your citizenship ceremony on our national day. Changing the date of a public holiday does not rewrite the past, nor does it resolve the systemic issues felt today from the past injustices perpetuated against Indigenous people. But it's an act of kindness, an act of recognition that we are seen and heard. It's a form of validation for Indigenous people and a part of a better day where we can all celebrate Australia. The democracy of Australia is imperative to its success. We are fortunate to live in the greatest country, but we should not continue to lie about the foundation of our nation, nor continue to use the date of Australia Day as a tool for division. We can do better. Right now, we are letting the past haunt us through hidden layers of untold truth. It is a fragmented system that we can slowly improve, but only if we change too. It's an act of kindness. It's a method of healing through sharing our national truth. It's simple and the right thing to do. Thanks for watching Paint It Black with me, Emma Garlett. Don't forget to subscribe so you never miss an episode.